Hello everyone and welcome to Chateau Dreams, our family vlog of moving here and our life and adventures in our 51 room castle in the deep south of France. I can't believe we've nearly been here for three years, having initially started on our own and then having help from some volunteers and so on. It's wonderful here. We have a lot of renovation to do. We also go on some adventures in the local area, meet some lovely volunteers and try and squeeze in some of this super French culture here. Thanks so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe. As you can see, we now have some sunshine here at the castle, which is great. And I'm currently standing in the Rose Garden and you get a different elevation of the castle behind me. So this is one of the sides of the castle and the depth of the castle, if you like. And as you can see, we are a few rooms deep here. Oh, did you just see that wing? I'm delighted to announce that Beans and I together Yes, Beans is back. Uh, Beans and I together have trimmed the peacock's wings and they've now been released back into the park. Although at night time, they'll be going into their peacock house to just settle them down and keep them cosy. Wherever you are, I hope you're having a wonderful week and thanks so much for joining us. Gosh, guess what? I've just got the kids back from school and it's jolly freezing in the kitchen. I didn't bother to pop the fire on today because Ross and I have been working actually at the other end of the castle in the Grand Salon. He did his interview podcast from there today and I was working in there just because it was so lovely and warm with the fire on. The kids are just back from school so I popped them safely in there where it's really toasty and warm and we're actually going out for supper later. In the meantime, I think I'd like to prepare them a hot, tasty treat. So I saw a recipe on the BBC for hot buttered apple juice, and that's what I'm gonna try and make. I think the me. idea behind this recipe originally was that it was a treat if you're thinking of having a dry January, so alcohol free. But obviously that means it's also completely suitable for children, which is great. In the recipe, they say, 110 grams of butter, which I've got here, and in addition to that, 110 grams of sugar, which I'm just in the process of weighing out. In fact, I've got a bit too much. So I'm using a nice brown cane sugar, which should be good, and uh, I'm just going to pour that into the butter that's in here, very simply, and then you add a good dollop of winter spices. So here I have some four spice, and this has got some cinnamon, some ginger, and some cloves in it. Yummy. Just chuck a load of that in there like that. And then a little bit of nutmeg in there as well, I think. I think I might need a bit more, actually. I do love the smell of these winter spices. Ross is not so keen, but actually he's probably not going to be trying this, so I can go completely crazy. Right, the next thing you've got to do is blend it all together. I do have a trusty blender here, but actually today I'm going to use a bit of good old fashioned elbow grease and a fork. So the idea is to cream the butter. I must say it does smell heavenly. In the BBC recipe, they do add a little bit of lemon juice. They actually have 15 mils of lemon juice, I guess to split the butter up a bit. But I don't have any lemon juice, so we're just going to try it as is. Then you simply pop it into a saucepan and warm it up and stir it around, making sure all the butter and all the spices are nicely melted. And then you get to eat it. Hooray! What do you think, Scarlett? 
Okay, this might be a bit hot. Yes. So, what did you think? Uh, warming, tasty. Okay, yeah, so I think that's a thumbs up then from Mr. Miller. Hey, so everybody seemed to enjoy it, which is great. And for those of you that want to try this at home, here's the recipe. Enjoy! So it's 750 mils of apple juice, 110 grams of butter, 110 grams of sugar, two tablespoons of mixed spice, and it'll serve four people. Well, everyone, thanks so much for watching, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Take care now. Bye-bye. Feels like love, Cupid made a shot, straight into my heart. Now I'm falling fast and my world's expanding Feels like love